When Oklahoma City residents passed MAPS 3, a modern streetcar system was one of eight ambitious projects included in the plan. The modern streetcar is advancing as we prepare for construction to begin in late 2016. This new transportation system will connect key destinations and further spur development in downtown and surrounding areas. Streetcars travel with traffic on rails embedded in the street. Commuters, downtown professionals, visitors, and others will use the streetcar to get around the downtown area. Six vehicles are being built in Brookville, Pennsylvania. Each streetcar is 67 feet long and 8 feet wide and will hold more than 100 passengers. The multiple entrances, low floors, and onboard bicycle racks mean you can roll your bikes, strollers, or wheelchairs easily on board. The sleek design and frequent service will help you get around quickly while leaving your car at home or in a parking garage. The route connects all the districts in the downtown area from Midtown through Automobile Alley, the Central Business District, Arts District, Bricktown, the new Maps 3 Park, Convention Center, and Convention Center Hotel. The main line, or north-south line, spans 4.6 miles and will run five streetcars, creating a 10 to 12 minute frequency or headway. The east-west line will have an additional dedicated vehicle. Riders will conveniently find a stop every two to three blocks. The streetcar will stop near the Embark Transit Center and Santa Fe Station to tie into other transportation systems. Embark will operate the streetcar for optimal transit integration. Streetcars will also feature wireless technology that will allow them to travel off-wire for several blocks. Rail and maintenance facility construction will start in the fall of 2016 and continue through 2018. The vehicles are on order now and will begin delivery in 2017. After a period of testing, the system will be ready for operation. The streetcar will encourage economic growth along the route and make downtown Oklahoma City a more vibrant place to live. For more information on this and other MAPS 3 projects, visit okc.gov maps3.